My name is Nancy Haddon and I am the facilitator for Rachel's Vineyard for the Kamloops Diocese. Rachel's Vineyard is a healing ministry for those who have been wounded from the trauma of abortion. Faith in Action generously provides a grant to us each year in order that we may put on these retreats which are held here at the Immaculate Heart of Mary Shrine and Retreat Center. The ministry is called Rachel's Vineyard because Rachel is a figure from the Old Testament in the book of the prophet Jeremiah and she is mourning her children because they are no more. But the Lord says to her to cease her cries of mourning because there is hope for her future. And it is called a vineyard because Christ is the vine and we are the branches. And we know that without him we can do nothing. This is the gathering room where the bulk of the healing sessions take place. In this room there would only be the retreat team and the participants on the retreat. Everything that happens in this room is confidential. It's not shared with any of the support team and it's not shared with anybody outside of the retreat either. Another area that we use at Rachel's Vineyard is the chapel. We use the chapel, of course, for Mass and the Sacrament of Reconciliation, but we also do some living scripture exercises here, as well as the memorial service. Like the woman in scripture who reached out to touch the cloak of Christ, we too must take a risk and reach out to Christ in order to receive his healing. Most of the time when the participants arrive for the retreat, they're quite scared, they're very nervous, they're uncertain. It's just an amazing process that they go through in the three days that they're here because by the time they leave on the third day, they really truly are new people with new life. And they have a peace and a joy about them that many of them have not experienced for a very, very long time because the church recognizes how much pain abortion brings and the church really is the place to go for healing. We are very blessed on our retreats. We actually have two priests here to help facilitate the healing.